Billings attorney and Democratic congressional candidate John Heenan has been touting his background as a consumer lawyer, representing people ripped off by banks and insurers. But as MTN's Mike Dennison reports, Heenan was also involved in a major environmental lawsuit targeting the coal strip power plants. U.S. House candidate John Heenan, one of five Democrats competing for their party's nomination to challenge Republican Congressman Greg Gianforte this fall, has won some big cases as a plaintiff's attorney, like a $2 million judgment for a Billings couple that had a wrongful foreclosure on their home, and a $2.7 million award against Geico Insurance when it refused to pay benefits to a Billings woman whose husband was killed by an uninsured driver in 2011. I stick up for people against banks, against payday lenders. I get to represent widows when insurance companies deny their claims. I'm, I'm very proud of what I do, and really it's uh, what I want to continue to do as, as Montana's representative in Congress. Yet he also was one of two lawyers filing the suit by environmental groups against the owners and operators of the coal strip power plants in 2013 accusing them of clean air violations. That suit was settled in 2016, with coal strip owners agreeing to shut down plants one and two by the year 2022. Heenan was asked at a debate earlier this month whether his role in the case could become a point of attack by Republicans this fall. I don't think so at all. Um, you know, my background, and I've been unabashed about it, is I stand up for people against um, corporations that violate the law. And the circumstances of that case was um, there was a corporation that couldn't comply with the Clean Air Act. He says work on the case later transferred to other lawyers for the environmental groups and that his involvement was minimal. Heenan also says he's visited Coal Strip several times during the campaign and supports efforts to help its workers. The other candidates in the Democratic primary are former Land Trust Director Grant Keir of Missoula, Bozeman lawyers John Meyer and Jared Pettinato, and former state lawmaker Kathleen Williams of Bozeman. Some of them have suggested Heenan's involvement in the coal strip case could hurt him among eastern Montana voters. Heenan's extensive record as a lawyer no doubt will be fodder in the campaign should he win the June 5th primary. The question is, will it be a positive or a negative? Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News. Absentee voting in this race and other races is already underway and will conclude on Election Day, June 5th.